I quit. Oh, Gil. Forget it. Phil brought you some big clients. You're happy. Oh, Gil. I'm just going to call my clients, give them the news, and I'm out of here. Friday's my last day. Don't make me a party. Gil. Dave. <laughs> The other kids got picked up. Ours are watching and tape, and Helen just dropped your grandma off. Let's talk. I quit my job. Why? They gave the partnership to Phil Richards. Phil Richards. This is a guy who, who, who leaves his wife and kids and then puts all his money in his girlfriend's name so they can't touch him for child support. I mean, the guy is... <sighs> anyway, I couldn't stand it. I snapped. Can you still change your mind? What do you mean, change my mind? I quit. I know, but did you say anything that would make it difficult for them to take you back? Jesus, honey, I was hoping you'd be a little more supportive. It's not like I... I'm pregnant. Since when? Since I, I am. I'm due in February. I didn't want to say anything till I was sure. How did this happen? It was an accident. Anyhow, this is why I'm saying maybe now this isn't the best time for you to be out of work or, or starting a new job. You know, if you'd told me there was a chance of this happening, I might not have quit in the first place. Well, you never told me there was a chance you might quit. It was a spur-of-the-moment decision. Pretty big one. So what are you saying I should do? Crawl back to work and kiss Dave's feet and get my crappy job back? I quit. If I, if I go back now, they, they got me. I, I'm a eunuch. You know, this, this puts a minor crimp in my life, too. I, I was thinking about starting back to work in the fall. Now I can't. Well, that's the difference between men and women. Women have choices, men have responsibilities. Oh, really? Oh, okay, well, then I choose for you to have the baby, okay? That's my choice. You have the baby. You get fat. You breastfeed till your nipples are sore. I'll go back to work. All right, let's return from La La Land, because that ain't gonna happen. And whether I crawl back to Dave or I get another job, it's obvious now I'm gonna have to spend less time at home. I'm gonna have to have business dinners, and I'm gonna have to play racquetball, and I'm gonna have to get guys laid. So I hope you don't mind if I bring a few prostitutes home, honey, because that's what it takes to get anywhere, and I'm not getting anywhere. So whatever happens, you have to count on less help from me. Why don't you just say what you're really thinking? What am I thinking? That I should have an abortion? I didn't say that. It's a decision every woman has to make on her own. What, are you running for Congress? Don't give me that. I want your opinion about what we should do. Let's pretend it's your decision, okay? Pretend you're, you're a caveman or, or your father. What do you want me to do? I want... I want whatever you want. Well, I want to have the baby. Well, great. Let's have it then. Let's see how I can screw the fourth one up. Hey, let's have five. Let's have six. Let's have a dozen and pretend they're donuts. I'm really happy about the way things are turning out, aren't you? You know, with the frame of mind you're in, not only am I not sure we should have another baby, I'm not sure we should keep the three we've got. Well, I'm ready to discuss it. However, I can't right now because I gotta go to the goddamn Little League. Ten little boys are waiting for me to guide them into last place. You really have to go? My whole life is have to. Come on, Kevin, get your glove. 
I know that I said it, but now I'm changing my mind. I have to go, you have to go. Move it. 